Today, I'm going to be showing you how to increase your FPS in-game while keeping your visibility and quality in Arena Breakout Infinite. This is a no BS tutorial, so let's get right into it. First, you're going to go to your game settings and you're going to set your field of view between 100 and 110. It's personal preference, but you want at least 100. 110 will give you a little bit less FPS, but you'll get more visibility. Moving down here, you're going to want to make sure you turn head shake to low. This is very important in terms of keeping your visibility. You're going to hit save, and then you're going to move to your image settings. In your image settings, you're going to make sure your aspect ratio is the ratio of your monitor. Your screen resolution is your native resolution. Your screen mode is full screen to reduce any input lag. Your super sampling type is DLSS if you have an NVIDIA graphics card. If you have an AMD graphics card, you're going to set this to FSR. From there, you're going to set super sampling quality to quality. Your max FPS you want to turn all the way up. VSync is turned off. Enable main screen frame rate limit should be turned on and variable rate rendering should be turned on. View distance should be high, shadow quality low, resolution low, post processing quality low, texture quality medium, effect quality low, vegetation quality low, shader quality low, light quality low, and scope quality you want to actually have on quality. And you're going to save that. And then you're going to move to post processing and you're just going to make sure that your sharpening ideally should be around one or two, but you can put it higher if you want, but it will cause some distortion. So I would recommend putting it at around one or two and testing what you like the best. From there, those are the settings to have the best FPS and quality in Arena Breakout Infinite. If you have any questions, drop them down below. If you like no bullshit tutorials, drop a like. Peace.